In the summer of 1977, humanity embarked on a daring adventure. It was a time of great ambition and curiosity as we sought to extend our reach beyond the confines of our home planet. Two spacecraft, Voyager 1 and Voyager 2, soared into the cosmos. These twin explorers were designed to journey farther than any human-made object had ever gone before. Their mission? To explore the outer giants of our solar system. These planets, shrouded in mystery, held secrets that could unlock the history and evolution of our cosmic neighborhood. These robotic emissaries carried with them our hopes and dreams. They were not just machines, they were symbols of human ingenuity and our unquenchable thirst for knowledge. They also carried instruments to observe and record. These sophisticated tools would gather data on the planet's atmospheres, magnetic fields and more, sending back invaluable information to Earth. The Voyager probes became our eyes and ears across unimaginable distances. Through their lenses and sensors we could witness the wonders of the outer solar system as if we were there ourselves. The twin probes launched a few weeks apart. Each launch was a testament to the meticulous planning and precision engineering that went into the Voyager program. Voyager 2 embarked on its journey first, on August 20th. It was the beginning of an odyssey that would take it to the far reaches of our solar system. Voyager 1 followed on September 5th. Though it launched second it would eventually overtake its twin and become the farthest human-made object from Earth. Their trajectories were carefully planned. Scientists and engineers calculated precise paths that would allow the spacecraft to use the gravitational pull of the planets to slingshot further into space. The goal was to utilize a rare planetary alignment. This unique configuration occurs only once every 176 years, making the timing of the Voyager missions crucial. This alignment would allow them to visit all four gas giants, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. Each flyby would provide a gravitational boost, propelling the spacecraft to the next destination. It was a once-in-a-176-year opportunity. The chance to explore these distant worlds in a single mission was unprecedented and would not come again for many generations. The Voyagers were ready to uncover the secrets of these celestial giants. Their journey would transform our understanding of the solar system and inspire future generations to continue the quest for knowledge. The Voyager probes revolutionized our understanding of the outer solar system. Their close encounters with Jupiter revealed the Great Red Spot as a massive storm. It was larger than the Earth and raged for centuries. Voyager 1 discovered a thin ring encircling Jupiter. It also found three new moons, Thebe, Metis, and Adrastia. Voyager 2 continued the journey reaching Saturn in 1981. It sent back stunning images of the planet's majestic rings. These rings were revealed to be made up of countless icy particles. The probe discovered new moons and even shepherd moons. These small moons kept the rings in line. The data collected by Voyager 2 helped scientists study Saturn's atmosphere and magnetic field. After their encounters with Jupiter and Saturn, the Voyager probes had achieved remarkable milestones. The Voyager probes could have easily ended their missions at this point, having fulfilled their primary objectives. Their primary objectives were complete, and they had sent back invaluable data about these giant planets. However, the spacecraft still had some fuel left in their reserves, which opened up new possibilities. Additionally, their scientific instruments were still functioning perfectly, ready to gather more data. So, instead of concluding their journey, they ventured onward, into the uncharted territory of the outer solar system. This extended mission would prove to be just as groundbreaking and significant as their initial encounters with Jupiter and Saturn. Voyager 1, moving faster than its twin, Voyager 2, raced ahead into the depths of space. It became the first human-made object to cross the heliopause, a monumental achievement in space exploration. The heliopause is the boundary where the solar wind from our sun gives way to the interstellar medium, marking the edge of our solar system. This historic event took place in August 2012, marking a new chapter in our understanding of space. Voyager 1 entered a new realm of space, venturing into the vast and unexplored interstellar medium. It began sending back data about the conditions in this unexplored region, providing scientists with unprecedented insights into the nature of interstellar space. Whispers from the Edge, the Heliosphere, and Beyond In this section we delve into the fascinating discoveries made by the Voyager probes as they journeyed to the far reaches of our solar system and beyond. The data from Voyager 1 provided invaluable insights into the Heliosphere, a region that acts as a protective bubble around our solar system, 
shielding us from the harsh environment of interstellar space. The heliosphere is a giant bubble that surrounds our solar system, created by the continuous flow of charged particles known as the solar wind, which emanates from the sun. It is created by the solar wind which pushes against the interstellar medium forming a boundary known as the heliopause. The probe measured the density of the interstellar medium, providing crucial data that helps scientists understand the transition from our solar bubble to the vast expanse of interstellar space. It also detected interstellar magnetic fields, which are different from those within the heliosphere, offering new insights into the magnetic environment of our galaxy. These discoveries helped us better understand the region between the stars, known as the interstellar medium, which is filled with gas, dust, and cosmic rays. Voyager 2 followed suit in 2018, embarking on its own journey to the edge of the heliosphere and beyond. It crossed the heliopause at a different location, providing a comparative analysis that enriched our understanding of the heliosphere's shape and dynamics. This provided even more data about the shape and structure of the heliosphere, revealing that it is not a perfect sphere, but rather an elongated bubble influenced by the interstellar medium. The two probes, now billions of miles apart, continue to send back faint signals, offering a continuous stream of data from the edge of our solar system. They are testament to the incredible distances they have traveled, far beyond the orbits of the outer planets and into the unknown. Their journey is a reminder of the vastness of space, a vastness that continues to inspire and challenge our understanding of the universe. Engineering Marvels, a testament to human ingenuity. The Voyager probes are a testament to human ingenuity. They were designed and built with technology from the 1970s, yet they have endured the harsh conditions of space for over four decades. Their longevity is a marvel of engineering. The probes are powered by radioisotope thermoelectric generators, or RTGs. These generators use the heat from decaying plutonium to generate electricity. They have enough power to keep the instruments running for several more years, their design and construction were ahead of their time, they have far exceeded their expected lifespan.